So you're thinking about moving to Evans, Georgia, but before you do, you wanna know everything about living there, including like proximity to uh, maybe downtown Augusta or the airport or Atlanta, maybe recreation and parks and attractions and things that are going all around. And that's really what this video is all about, is helping you get comfortable with Evans before you get there. And then if you stick around to the end, we'll do a market report. We'll go over all the data, economy, real estate, market, that kind of stuff. So if you have any interest in living in Evans, you're gonna to wanna to stick around for that and we're gonna get after it right now. Hey, if this is your first time to the channel and you wanna know everything there is to know about eating, sleeping, working, playing the good and the bad of living in Georgia, whether it's Atlanta or Augusta, or in this case, Evans, well then subscribe below and ring the bell for notifications so you can be the first to know about the real estate market there in Evans. My name is Denny, the team and I get calls each and every day from people just like you looking to make the move to Georgia and we absolutely love it. So whether you're moving next week, next month, or even next year, then give us a call, shoot us a text, or send us an email and we'd be happy to help you make a smooth move to Augusta or Evans. Uh, like I mentioned in this video, we're going to give you a tour around town and kind of give you a lay of the land. We're going to do that on the computer on Google Maps. So let's hop in there and get started. All right, here we are. And well, I guess I should uh, <laughs> undo that and get back to my mouse. I'm going to move my head out of the way. Here we are in Evans. And as you can see, uh, this is what they're calling Evans, but really, um, the primary zip code is 30809. So this is the big uh, Evans area. And if we want to get in there to like down town Evans. Oh, well, it's not really called downtown. So I guess I'll just zoom in and show it to you. I did a um, my vlog on uh, Evans was in this Evans Town Center Park, which is really what I consider the downtown area. And the reason I say that is because it's where the there you see the library and the playgrounds, the county offices, City Hall, all of that stuff is uh, right here. The Performing Arts Theater, Lady A Amphitheater. So here in this area, I was standing right out here in the middle. Um, but here's Lady A Amphitheater. You can see an idea. There's regional con concert venues. You can see a uh, very popular place, fireworks. That's what it looks like during the daytime. So that's Lady A. And then um, I did my uh, market update from this Stay Social tap. Uh, I really enjoyed it. I grabbed uh, um, actually uh, a beer from a brewery up in Alpharetta, Georgia while I was there. Uh, uh there's lady a and here's evans town center you can look out there's a um playgrounds uh, aside from the amphitheater uh water fountain park that kind of stuff that's there in that vicinity there's another playground right across the way there you go there's more of that there and then uh here's the sheriff station city hall all of that, right? And so I call this really the downtown Evans area right here. Um, this is Washington Road. Let me move this up so I can use my little highlighter. So this is Washington Road. It runs through Evans. And what might help is I'll give you a, a broader perspective uh, to begin with. And we're gonna keep this short and sweet, but this is Washington Road. It runs down through Martinez Evans into Augusta and Evans is in Columbia County. It's a suburb of Augusta. So you have Augusta and then Martinez and then Evans. Grovetown is another popular one, but because of its proximity here, um, you see I-20 runs east to west to uh, Columbia to the east, Atlanta to the west. And this Savannah River separates Georgia from South Carolina. So um, once you cross that river, you're over into North Augusta versus Augusta. But uh, just to give you some maybe commute and uh, travel times, if you were going from Evans and you wanted to go just to 
inner city Atlanta. That's about two hours and seven minutes. And then if it was Evans to uh, Hartsfield Jackson International Airport, that's about two hours and 11 minutes versus the Augusta Regional Airport, which is just 20 minutes. But by the time you go there, go through uh, baggage claim and get checked in and do all that stuff and get on the plane and then fly to Atlanta to connect to where you're going. A lot of times people just go to Atlanta, but um, they also go over to Columbia, South Carolina. There's an airport there. Uh, that's the closest, you know, metro. In Evans, there's, uh, and the CSRA Atlanta is like 800,000 people and all of Augusta and surrounding areas. And then Columbia is a little bit bigger than that. And obviously Atlanta is like millions and millions and millions of people. So from Evans um, to look at this, you'll see this huge lake, Clarks Hill. Well, if you like lake life, you are right next to it that's clark's hill south carolina it's right across the border so here's the you're like why is it in south carolina here's the border on the savannah river and so this is evans all of this is georgia all of this is south carolina so from evans up to pollard's corner this is where most people go to the lake and then you can either shoot across here or go up here uh, but that is what lake life looks like if you're living uh, in the Evans area. But let's uh, shoot back downtown before I, or in that central Evans area so I can show you a few other things. One of the things that's uh, out here that I love is taco sushi out in evans this is one of my favorite places very very yummy it's like an asian uh latin kind of a feel taco sushi you get it and then the uh, um tuscany spa italian another friend of mine the keels Leanne, her husband, uh, Matt, passed away tragically uh, a few months ago. My heart goes out to her, but that, that is a, a fabulous salon. Uh, the medical community is going to be a really big uh, influence there in Augusta. Reinhardt's is a really popular restaurant uh, where you can get oysters and uh, seafood and things of that nature. Um, if I zoom into this uh evans town center park uh tax layer tax um processing software you may have used uh, it is known nationally but here's the evans fitness club this is a popular attraction uh, everyone works out here and it has everything you can possibly imagine bunch of stock photos but i was like i know there's actually real people working out and playing squash and hitting the bags and training and doing all that stuff so that's evan's fitness club is right there the the really uh, main um high schools around evans i went to uh let me zoom in just a tad i went to lakeside high school which is right over this direction here. And then um, Evans, why is my mouse not working? Evans High School is gonna be over here on this side. And then up Washington Road, there's Windmill Plantation, there's the Publix. So Greenbrier High School, yep, found it. <laughs> Greenbrier High School is right up here. And so those are the three main uh, high schools. Over in Martinez, um, this way, there's uh, the Savannah 
a river pavilion to, uh, just there it is this is a gorgeous place this was uh where i started my martinez vlog uh but another really great place where you can get out in nature and go walking or biking or running um and they also have a big pavilion for events like oh there you go and things of that nature so that's right over in very close proximity to evans um champions retreat is a Palmer player Nicholas designed uh, golf course in community. So that's out near Greenbrier High School. Um, let me see if it'll, yep, there's Greenbrier High School. And so here's Washington Road um, and it cuts into here and this is where the high school is. But the golf course is way down here towards the end. And you can see that it's an absolute beautiful course that has beautiful homes all around it. Um, so if you're into golf and you're going to live in Evans, well, Champions Retreat is definitely an area that you need to take a look at. They have a club and all, all the amenities and even these cabins are for rent. I have lots of friends who are members. I've played it numerous times. I've stayed in these cabins. Uh, really great, great, great uh, golf course if you're in to the golf scene. And so we've talked about the proximity to the surrounding cities, um, the lake. Uh, as well as what's going on in that downtown area. Uh, why don't we just do some, uh, let me get bring you up to speed on the overall market. Um, Evans was actually ranked the best place to live in America last year in 2020 by Money Magazine. I know, crazy, right? The number one place in the entire country to live. And uh, you can find that online if you just Google money, money, uh, best places to live 2020. And they talk about the, you know, home values, diversity, economic opportunities, and all the things. So that's one thing I did want to point out is I'm not the only one that thinks it's a great place to live. Um, the MLS system in Augusta is kind of wonky. So it's easier just to show you on Zillow. But here's a snapshot of some of the properties. So the um, population in Evans is 35,000. Um, uh, and so it's a, not a huge market, but it's not tiny. There's everything you can need. Uh, it's a great place to raise a family. You know, if you're looking for a hop in nightlife, you're probably going to need to go to Atlanta for that. Um, not that you can't get into trouble if you want to, but it's probably not why you're moving uh, to Evans, Georgia. Uh, it is a phenomenal place to raise a family uh, and has high paying jobs. The median income is one hundred and ten thousand dollars which is a lot considering the median home value is $365,000. You can easily afford a home in Evans. There's great jobs, um, low, uh, uh, very uh, safe, a lot, of, a lot of great schools, very safe, great jobs, um, lots of economic opportunity and um, low home values. Not that they're not valuable, you get a lot of home for the money. For example, I just sold this particular property uh, about a week or two ago, and uh, that is uh, $375,000. And as you can see here, beautiful home, stacked stone, red door. I love the siding, how it's uh, vertical, and you have the cedar looking siding up there. Great curb appeal, well manicured, and uh, it looks just as good inside. So it was built maybe 10 years ago, fabulous home and uh, just 300 and I don't love the green paint, but hey, you know, you can change that. That doesn't require anything but uh, a paint can, a brush and a couple of hours to change the paint. Huge flat backyard, and as you can see, uh, four bedrooms, four bathrooms, 3,575 square feet for just $375,000. So a lot of bang for your buck there in Evans. Um, here's an example of what $260,000 looks like. Just uh, roll through a couple of these. So well, let me look at something really quick. Four bedrooms, three bathrooms, 2,000 square feet. So still uh, a very spacious home and it looks good again paint is always something that so not as high end of finishes but still a fabulous home lots of space uh and a great place to live and that's right at two that's two hundred and sixty thousand. and so um let's go look at something um i know at the bottom they'll have a nice there we go what's 1.3 million dollars look like that's in that um this is new construction six bedrooms, seven bathrooms, over 5,000 square feet. And this one is gorgeous, as you would expect for 1.3 million. 
uh, light flooring, coffered ceilings, built-ins, nice fixtures, high-end finishes, high-end appliances. Love the design. Mm, Spa-like bathroom. You get the picture. That is what 1.3 million, and maybe let's just pop into one kind of middle of the road. 535,000, five bedrooms, four bathrooms, 3,266 square feet. And this one looks beautiful as well. So that gives you an idea of what's going on in the market. Um, I try to do my best to provide as much value as possible uh, in these videos. And hopefully I did that, but you're welcome to add comments below if I missed something or if you think you can help somebody that's maybe watching. We wanna be a resource for anyone thinking about moving to Georgia. And in this case, Evans. So if you haven't already subscribe tap the bell for notifications we release a couple of videos a week so there's always something new for you to learn uh, in the market and hey uh, knowledge is power or should i say applied knowledge is power so uh, we'd love to be a resource if we can if you are moving give us a call shoot us a text send us an email schedule a zoom i'd love to get face to face and meet you and until i see you or in person or on zoom hopefully i will see you on another episode so Give us a shout. Love to help you out. Y'all have a great day.